Get this, guys. So Square Enix put Kingdom Hearts, an action RPG that has blocking and dodging mechanics that are so fast that it basically matches a military jet, on the Nintendo Switch cloud version. No, I'm not joking. Man, what a mess. Square Enix, I love you. Kingdom Hearts is like my child. But the decision shouldn't have even been on the table for a cloud version because this game requires responsiveness in your controls and you can never get that with a cloud version. Now, I'm one of those people who has really good internet. My internet is fire. And you know what? It worked great for a little bit. And then it didn't. And that's the problem. You can't have this wishy-washy bullshit with cloud versions on an action RPG. And especially an action RPG with super bosses in every damn title. It just makes no sense. And then even worse, with most people's internet that like either isn't the best or isn't even like the greatest, but it's still good. It just doesn't work very well. The resolution looks like dog water. The frame rate is non-existent. It's really bad. And I don't know what Square Enix were thinking. I think they really just pulled this out of their butts and just threw it. And they're like, Kingdom Hearts on Switch. Woo. And you know what's the craziest thing is, and I promise you, Kingdom Hearts 3 could also run natively on Switch. And you want to know why? Because they just have to drop the resolution. You know Xenoblade 2 runs at like 500p most of the time. And it, like it runs and it's people love that game. But it exists the art style still great you know what i mean kingdom Hearts 3 they could lower the res take out some of the shadows take out some of the foliage put the frame rate at 30 and it should run as long as when you click your buttons on your controller it's responsive and you can see what's going on you know it's it really baffles me that they even put it on the switch i'm literally just making this video to rant by the way because it just blows my mind after playing the demos of how bad those actually were and i just feel bad for switch owners like people who only have a switch that they can't experience this amazing series and man it's it's just crazy i'm really really hoping square enix i mean i don't think they're gonna just pull these off the store for the cloud versions i don't think they could do that but hopefully they could get native ports of the older games in the future because you know what's funny is the older games are actually more of a pain in the ass to put on there than KH3. I know I'm probably spitting some wild theories out here, but I just really believe so. Unreal Engine is easy to uh, optimize, whereas you, these old Kingdom Hearts games, who knows what the hell's going on with those engines and ports. So I just hope that they rethink it and eventually put it on there. The other issue is that the Switch is a pile of dog water and Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to have some issue being optimized for and it requires a lot of effort on Square's part and they don't want to do it. We need a Switch Pro that could handle these types of games by now. Kingdom Hearts 3 is a beautiful game, but it's not like the craziest, most taxing game you'll ever play you know what i mean so square enix just needs to rethink some of their decisions some of their business decisions come out of their butts at the speed of light and they just start you know here let's do this 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 money 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 holy crap square you guys got some amazing art don't be making such dumb decisions please from a fellow fan a fan that literally like adores you guys like i have i have too much merch seriously stop making me spend money but seriously, I hope this situation gets solved. I'm so sorry to all you Switch owners. My advice is if you have an old laptop or desktop, even a shitter one, uh, the old Kingdom Hearts games are so easy to run, you could probably run those games. I would honestly get them on the Epic Games Store. Not KH3. You're going to have to wait somehow other way to play KH3, and that's unfortunate. But technology is growing, so Nintendo needs to grow with that technology. And with that, I bid y'all beautiful Kingdom Hearts fans a farewell. Later.